everybody, welcome back to video two for TubeSpy. In this video, we're going to cover the actual detailed operation of the software and how you can use it to start making some money. So the first things first, we're going to go up to the uh, toolbar here and we're going to click on similar keywords. Now the similar keywords tool is actually one that you're going to use to find the keywords. So if you already have a keyword in mind, you know, you can skip this part, but if not, you can use this for some great ideas. So let's say that uh, I wanted to get into the World of Warcraft niche. Uh, World of Warcraft is abbreviated just WOW -W or WOW. And so I'm going to type in WOW. And one of the biggest selling um, items in that niche happens to be gold guides. So I'm just going to type in WOW gold guides. And I'm going to select 100 results. I want to try to get back 100 different uh, keywords. Select OK. and the software pulled back 85 similar keywords to WOW Gold Guides so now I can just look through the keywords and kind of find out you know if there's something in there that interests me it's going to give me the broad exact and phrase you know search counts now me personally I like to use exact it's just you know the numbers aren't as big but I get a more realistic expectation of how many views uh, my video might get if I rank on YouTube but the important thing to keep in mind here is if you rank on YouTube, these numbers, you know, are what you're going to be basing your views off of. But you can also rank on Google. So, you know, it's a great idea to check the Google keyword tool as well, so that you can get a a big picture, so to speak, of how many searches these keywords are actually getting. And the nice thing is, as you go down the list of keywords, you can see that some of these do not have a video on the front page of Google yet. So, what I like to do is we can actually organize this list here by clicking on this. Oops. and it's going to basically bring up looks like about 10 to 20 videos or excuse me keywords that don't have a video on page one and so I can go through these keywords and see which one looks like a good keyword to me and you know just because I know the niche I know that uh, Zygor guides whoops is in a really really popular uh, World of Warcraft guide and I can see there's no video on page one so that might be a keyword that I would want to target and uh, make a video for it and get it ranked okay so let's do this uh, let's take a look we've got Zygor guides here we're going to use that as our keyword let's jump over to the YouTube analyzer and type in Zygor guides and now this is going to go out and analyze YouTube itself and we can select anywhere from 10 to a thousand results I'm going to leave it at 50 which is the default you see there it takes it just a few seconds and what it's done it's went to YouTube and pulled back the top 50 videos for Zygor guides now remember Zygor guides isn't getting a whole lot of search volume on YouTube itself uh, when these numbers say zero it's not necessarily zero the keyword probably is being searched but there wasn't enough data on YouTube's keyword tool to you know give us any solid figures but as we look through the videos here there's a few things that we want to pay special attention to we want to look at the title that the video is using and remember you can move these columns left and right so if you need to see more you can move it over if you need to see less shrink it back uh, this of course is the URL of the video so if you know if you're wanting to shoot a video but you're not really sure um, what to say or what your video should look like you can just click on the URL and it'll open the video up for you and you can kind of watch somebody else and you know grab some ideas that way shows the page rank of the video which this being a zero that's uh, that's a good sign that you could probably outrank them uh, the YouTube rating the number of likes and dislikes so you can see here this video is not real popular gives you the description so when you do your own video you can kind of model what they're already using that's working now the description link is extremely important because if you don't want to do your own videos or even if you are doing your own videos already a quick way to make some money is to actually use somebody else's hard work and you know basically we call that leverage um, you can leverage other video creators hard work to make money and, and you know uh, basically it doesn't take hardly any effort on your part at all all you need to do is look for videos that do not have a link in the description and to do that you can just click this and it's going to basically 
reorganize everything and show you the videos that don't have a link and what will happen is if you right click the video here you can send a message you see here you can send a message right to the owner of that video and we're going to give you a template so that you know exactly what to say so that you can try to rent or even buy those videos with those high view counts all right but moving along of course we have the number of views the number of comments the number of people who have favorited that video the date the video was published the tags so again if you're trying to get ranked and you're not sure what to use for tags go ahead and copy what the top ranked videos are doing get the category and then of course the username now once you've contacted the user it's a great idea to go ahead and check them off so that you uh, you know can keep track of who you have and have not sent messages to now another thing that you can use that's going to help you to rank your own videos is this tool down at the bottom it's going to calculate the averages for the number of results you choose now you can change this um, you know to less than 10 or more than 10 results but we highly recommend you leave it set at 10 because what that is doing is analyzing the front page for you and the software has its own algorithm that it uses to determine whether or not it's going to be easy medium or hard to rank for that keyword so it pulls back all these averages and gives you your ranking right here so this keyword would be easy to rank for now if you want to analyze the backlinks of your com uh, competitors you can simply select the video over here right click it and show backlinks and that's going to pull back you know this video has 8042 backlinks and that's going to pull back by default 50 URLs where those backlinks are located at. If you want to get more, um, you know, backlinks or more URLs, you certainly can. What you'll need to do is go ahead and first click on the URL, and then go ahead and copy from your browser. Come back to TubeSpy, select the video backlinks option, and put the URL in the box. Now I'm going to change this from 50 to 500. And it's going to take it just a second and actually pull back this time it was able to pull back a hundred of those links so just like you know other keyword softwares out there it's not going to be able to find every single link but it's going to find a good portion of them and you can use those links to try to reverse engineer what your competitors are doing and basically overtake them in the rankings so that is really in a nutshell that's what um, TubeSpy is all about. Now remember, you can save your project, you can export your projects, and if you want to filter the data, especially on this uh, YouTube Analyzer screen, you know you can actually go ahead and set some filters up. You just click the button up here, you select the column that you're wanting to filter. Whoops! First, select your plus button. Select the column you're wanting to filter by. So let's say that we wanted to filter uh, by views. We would select views, and then we only want to show videos that have views greater or equal to let's say 10,000 and let's go okay so now it's sorted through all those videos and the only ones that remain are videos that have more than 10,000 views if we want to clear the filter we simply click clear filter and it's going to bring them all back for us all right so very very simple stuff remember you can move all the columns you can sort the columns simply by clicking on them from highest to lowest and don't forget you can right click to show backlinks and also send messages. So that is how TubeSpy works and uh, we're very excited to uh, you know, hear about you guys' results with the software and you know, let us know if there's anything you'd like to see in future updates. We will be uh, updating it for you so we'd love to hear from you. So until next time, thanks for checking out the video.